My name is Brian Schultz. I live in, around Staplers, Nebraska. I live on a, a farm where we grow corn, soybeans, and a little bit of seed corn with my family. We got, a lot, we got enough acres that we keep busy. Some days we, uh, we feel like we don't have enough, and other days we feel like we have way too much. As our operation has changed, and we've expanded a little bit as far as geographically, uh, trying to get home every night and, and uh, park next to a stationary tank to get everything filled up has become uh, near impossible. So in 2013, uh, we got our first Thunder Creek trailer, and uh, it really, really saved us a lot of time. And we could tell right away by looking at it that it was that it was built well, uh, and that it was probably going to help our operation immensely. So we wouldn't have to go home to the stationary tanks every night. As diesel exhaust fluid evolved with the uh, equipment, the tractors, the combines, the trucks, um, we looked to our, our second Thunder Creek trailer. And so, uh, 2017, we bought. Our second Thunder Creek, because of the diff, being able to have that as part of your uh, operation uh, is almost going to be essential moving forward, in my opinion. We've got some older pumps some, uh, with some stationary tanks, and and you can spend you know 10, 15 minutes anymore nowadays filling up a, a large uh, tank with these newer. Thunder Creek trailers, they're, they're quite a bit quicker, yes, absolutely, and, and for us it saves us, you know, what you can do in five minutes with these might have taken 15 minutes with our old stationary tanks. Probably the thing I like most about Thunder Creek is the safety with them, because when we hook them to a pickup truck and start hauling them up and down the roads, we're on gravel a lot, we're on some highway, they follow behind a pickup truck really, really well, and they're very safe. Not only are they, do they follow well, they have great lighting. Thunder Creek's just allowed us to uh, be more efficient. I mean, and you're not spending that time chasing down a, a stationary tank to fuel up. Uh, you're not trying to run around with a, a cage of death. Um, we got everything in one place. So we're saving a lot of time and uh, keeping things moving, getting started earlier. Uh, and being able to run just a little bit later every night because uh, we're able to go to the field with these things and, and take care of all the, the deaf and, and the diesel fuel needs. <laughs>